So in this video, we're going to demonstrate um, how active staking works with the incantation of Witchfall on the Phantom Opera. Um, um, I, the talking about this dashboard is a subject for a, a longer video, but effectively speaking, we're looking at these indications right now to determine how much money we can make from this uh, from this instrument. So. These three numbers right here represent annual percentage rate, daily percentage rate, and percentage rate per epoch. If you can tell, an epoch is about a quarter of a day. It's about six hours long. Um, this epoch percentage rate is based on the amount of Pyre Phantom that is, that, is, uh, that, is being, that is queued to be distributed to Pyre Phantom stakers. Now, you can see that there might be as many as 47 people that are staked right now that have this amount of uh, staked Pyre Phantom uh, they have this amount of Pyre Phantom stake. Now this right here might be too early to stake. I think that you should probably stake when we're around in the ultimate minute. If you're in our Discord, you'll actually receive a warning for when the ultimate minute is. Now over here, you see the 24 hour high and low. And this gives you an idea of the amount, like the, the spike that you could see in Pyre Phantom getting staked. So now we're right here, you can see the countdown, one minute, five seconds, four seconds, three seconds, two seconds. I'm gonna go ahead and stake my bag now Small, tiny bag, but I think it's very, very important for uh, educational purposes. Thankfully, the network is, uh, in fact, moving kind of fast today. Maybe if we have a large surge in activity, we might be lucky enough to lag the network. We've done that before. My staking transaction was submitted around the uh, 39 second mark. Let's see what happens. Well, Zonic, that's only if it processes. Yep. There you go. In theory, maybe process at the, the, the 19 second mark. And also, I don't even see any indication that I'm staked in yet. There we go. Literally, I jumped in at 15 seconds. Let's find out. Now here, you can see this number 264.6. Now, if more people are staking on top of that, which they are, you can see that my amount here is getting smoldered. You can see I'm down at a 263.54. So I was probably, uh, I probably received maybe like seven or eight smolderings right there. But the final EPR, which Zonic wasn't aware of, the final EPR is in fact, uh, seems like a little, a little under 2%, a little under 2% yield that I just made uh, on a dollar. Now, if that's not impressive to you, I need you to understand that I'm the smallest player in this game. In fact, I'm playing with 263, and if you just saw the above indication, as many as 600,000 Pyre Phantom was played with. So there is uh, 3,000 as much money as this being played with. So does that make sense? So if I'm playing with a dollar, yeah, there you go. If you happen to be in our Discord or follow our Twitter, you can see the screenshots of the amount of, uh, the amount of yield people capture from this game. And um, Zonic, if you weren't aware, um, what I did before this demo video is that I claimed all the emissions from the house wallet in order to jack up the amount of pending in camps in the meat address. Yeah, so yeah, I definitely, I definitely hedged, uh, I definitely hedged against that. So effectively right there, you can see that we still have 103 stakes and this right here might be the uh, indication of the last amount. Um, but this right here, with 103,000 staked, and I don't know who else is still in there still, but with 103,000 staked, you can see that the yield per epoch is still over 1%. In fact, it's a little under 5% daily. Um, this yield is available at all prices of Pyre Phantom, Pyre AVAX, or Pyre BNB. Um, these tokens are always the highest real yield tokens in EVM DeFi, uh, consistently. Every six hours, this is true. Uh, it, there's not another token around that is a rival to us. We are blowing them all out of the water. Uh, and that is due to the paradigm of active staking in the first place. I'm going to, for those of you still watching this video, rehearse what just happened. I do a cursory analysis of the metrics on the dashboard. Um, the metrics on the dashboard are there to help you understand what you can expect to gain. But arguably, the best way to really learn how that works is by practicing it. If you are in fact uh, participating in our Genesis, this is what we give you Genesis missions for. You should learn this with house money. Then effectively, you wanna to wait to the ultimate minute to stake. You're going to then stake, and then effectively at the transpiration of the epoch, which either you or another player needs to click this button to make happen, 
in camps, which is positive yield is distributed to everybody pro rata of what they have staked. Meaning whatever you have staked, that's going to be the proportional size of your positive yield. So any, any negative yield you incur from smoldering, if you learn how to play the game correctly, it will be offset with positive yield. You can, in fact, if you want to make the game even more accelerating, you can power swap with one of these buttons into another token just to uh, add a little bit of a color to the price charts. And that is a demonstration of the incandition witch fault. Again, if you, have, uh, con if you have questions or concerns about how this is done, please review the orange diagram. The orange diagram is, uh, again, a step-by-step -step on how this is performed. It is a uh, don't overthink it. I promise you uh, this was designed for the Web3 user base. Um, any game that you guys have learned in the past, whether that's poker or slot machines or even meme coins, if you can wrap your head around that, you can wrap your head around this. There is at maximum seven things you need to do, and that involves approval, approval transactions if it's seven. It's, it's Calling it seven is looking at it in the most elaborate way. Yes, but with these, with with the orange diagram, you will be able to assess effectively how much yield you can stand to capture. Yeah. Okay. BNB was doing wonderful. Yeah. BNB was doing wonderful. Yeah. I mean, a lot of people did really well today, and they should have. Wow. Avalanche did really well today. You know, Avalanche was doing what is that? That is that is almost 2.5 percent yield on Avalanche. So if you guys, you know, for those of you. Yeah. Well, for those of you, for those of you who were in attendance of the AVAX talk show yesterday, uh, you should have, you should have, uh, you should do the AVAX talk giveaway. Like I don't know how else to describe it. Yeah, you should definitely do the AVAX talk giveaway. Um, and um, yeah, like the, the the house money you get to to learn this game, uh, you can effectively as soon as you learn the game, which shouldn't take you more than maybe three tries. Um, you can begin compounding that money and just growing it and growing it and growing it. That's what everyone else is doing that have taken the, the time to learn this project. They are just continuing to grow their bag. Um, we don't really lose bullishness here. Why would you? At any price is the highest real yield token on that chain. And that's all. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this IWV demo.